Hey guys, so I'm in the middle of like cleaning my room and just um, uh, like dusting because at every end of the month um, part of my chore task is to dust my dresser and desk and then every week I have to clean the toilet. Um, and so I have been busy um, giving my room a lot of fall decor. I don't usually, I haven't done that in the past. I usually do some Christmas decorating, but I wanted to DIY a lot of fall decor. So I just wanted to show you some of what I've done so far. So let's get started. So this is my dresser that I just finished dusting. And so this is the stuff that is usually on my dresser. But then I switched out an Ikea potted plant that I have for this fake pumpkin that is plastic. And then I made a little DIY mini pumpkin with a bead and I glued a little pig plastic leaf on top. And then I made this derpy little pumpkin with pom-poms, and I just think it's so cute. And then I'm not really into Shopkins anymore, but I do still have some of my favorites. So I have the witchy hat. And then I have a derpy spider made out of a pom-pom, pipe cleaners, and googly eyes. And then when fall comes closer, I'm going to add a fall quote, but I haven't done that yet. I guess fall technically is here. But I just, I think I'm going to wait and put like Happy Halloween or something. Um, right now, there's just this Studio C quote. Um, but yeah. I would highly recommend getting one of those signs. I know they're super trendy right now. But they're super fun. And it's like, I, I try to change mine every month. So you can just have a different decor piece every month. that expresses like holidays or favorite quotes or whatever. And then I have this scented candle that is actually not mine, it's my mom's, but it smells just like pumpkins and it's super cozy and so I usually light it when I'm by myself because my sister hates candles. And then I totally made this like DIY haunted house out of a can of diced tomatoes. <laughs> and I think it looks pretty cute. I kind of wish I hadn't added the paint. Um, but yeah, I just had a soup can and I covered it with wrapping paper. And then I had some old dollhouse pieces, so I painted those. And then I have this little pistachio cat, um, Macaroon. See how to make them on her channel. And then I just painted some other accents. And um, yeah, I think it's pretty cute from this angle. And the roof was really hard to make, and I don't think I did a great job, but it's fine. Maybe I can try again next year and it'll look better. But I think it works. And then I just have my normal paint. I have this happy fall sign that looks pretty cute. It's not perfect, but I wrapped yarn and big popsicle sticks and then glued some of those same plastic pieces and said happy fall. It's pretty cute. It's not as cute as it could be, but I think it's okay. And then uh, please excuse my extremely messy bed right now, but I also have a happy Halloween pushing sign. <laughs> that I think is so cute. So that's actually it. I don't think I'm gonna make any more um, fall decorations. Um, we usually go a little bit more over the top and not really over the top, but we usually decorate a little bit more around Christmas time. <sighs> but um, I thought this was just some fun fall accents, fall slash Halloween, um, just to put me in the, in the spirit of things. Um, so yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed this super quick video. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.